you know. No, yeah. Good morning, good morning, good morning. I'm trying to deal with the electrical issues that I have created in Spog. So Brendan is dismantling the panel at the back. Has the panel come off? Yes. Okay, can I have a little look then, please? Just a look. look at this diabolical mess of wires. Do you realise that's like what most wires look like? No wonder when you touch something or move something, it all just goes everywhere. But look, this here... <clears throat> this is where I electrocute myself, you can't see. Oh, yeah, and it's not going to do a lot. This one here mm. is the one that has come loose. But I need to untap. What? I mean, what is this box? And um, what is this? Whoa! He had these funky lights in here when we bought it. I mean, what is this? What funky lights? He had funky lights. He had plugged in. He took them out. I can, I can tell you. Right, that's the fuse box. So this, I'm thinking, has something to do with this, which I think is the fridge. I think that's the fridge now connected. I believe. If we open it, it'll have a light. That's not connected. It's not a great connection either. It pops up and down. What about that one? Light. Let's leave that plugged in and see if it gets cold. But then, but then it's not going to because this isn't connected and this connects to. If we leave this open for a minute, it'll get to whatever temperature. It's but now the light's not working because I've when I've plugged oh, that in. Voltage. That's voltage. Right, but why are the lights not coming off? But if I undo that, now the lights are not working at all. Right, have you got any strippers? You've got wire stuff. I've never heard of I bought you wire strippers and a whole tool kit. I mean, the wire strippers stuff. were kind of bad because it, all they kept doing was tearing the end of the thing off. Right, well, I need a tool that's got wire strippers. And it wouldn't work on those ones because those are chunky. Okay, I need some wire strippers. How about you move this by area? Yeah. yeah, I need something to strip wires with. Uh, I know what needs to go in, but I need to find... Uh, why are the lights now not working when they were working? How about right. you give Hold on. That's not lights. Yes, it is. That's lights. That's lights. Now I... And see, I've got these two are totally disconnected, so that's probably why these switches don't work. Isn't it? Because they're not actually connected to any... Hold on, that's that, that's that one, that's the lights. So why is one wire not connected? Would that be connected to this? Right, let's get some, let's get some power going. But it's literally, literally like a wire cowboy has come in here. Rusting up some goddamn bonnets. Yeah, I mean how... Talk about flipping cowboys. Right. And this should be attached to something. Surely this should be attached to the wall. You let me go there and I can tell you. Yeah, first of all, I need some wire, something that will strip wire. So I need to strip this. Don't hit too much off. And then we'll work out why the watch call it's not working. Why the light switch is now not working. If I pull out this one, try it again. Huh? Try, try the light switch. Yeah, well it won't because that's the main connector, so the light switch isn't going to work because we've got the main connector done. We need something sharp at the bottom. Okay, shimmy shimmy. So it's not pointy, I'll just re-plug the one I unplugged to check. Oh, this one's just for that, okay. So this. Oh. Oops. Oops. We really need some wire trimmers. Do you think Dar Darren's bent? Yeah, Can I just use night? 
do you do it with knives? You strip the outside. It's what I did for the um. Oh, well, go get a knife oh. then. Go get a nice sharp okay, knife. Go, that. go do that How then. Why? The pack of pointy shears. Why are you making me do this? How about I go get you the pack of pointy shears that I was talking about yesterday? Oh, now he tells me. <sighs> this is clearly not how to do DIY in a van. See, look, and these it's got these loose wires hanging here that are not attached to anything. Electrics is not my strong point. I probably shouldn't be messing with this at all. Why is it all just such a big old faffy mess? Maybe that should be on there like that. Right, they are. Pointy shears and safety scissors. You, you do your thing. If not, I'll speak to why? Right. I don't chop a few bits. You need to keep my chocolate bit. Your sriracha things are. Oh, a barbecue one. Yeah, yeah. Barbecue yeah. One. Yeah. Sorry, barbecue. Mm -hmm. Lefty loosey, righty tighty, isn't it? I don't know. Lefty loosey, so I've got then to go. I start screwing one way and it doesn't work, so I do the other way and that doesn't work. Then I screw back and the other one starts working again. Right, but why is it now not working when it was working a minute ago? Damn it. Right, righty tighty. Okay. Oh, okay, that's on. Why is the lights not working now? <sighs> okay. We have power. We no longer have light power. Right, that's the lights. That's the lights. The lights go... Oh, poo. Just lost the screwdriver. It was working until I plugged that in. Does that mean I've blown a fuse? How the hell would you stick fuses? There's a few. There's fuses in this box. There's a fuse box here. Right, that. The light's still not working. The lights are not working. Okay, so what have we got? So the lights. This is ridiculous. The lights come down here. One goes this way, that all looks connected, and goes into there. Did we have two loose wires before? Yeah. Or just, we had two sh two loose stripped well, wires. One wasn't plugged into the third socket, it's the white one on the, um, the third socket. There's, not, there's power going into the switch, but there's no power going into the lights. Okay, let's follow, let's make sure all of those are plugged in, those are all plugged in. The black cable goes into this, that goes into this. Is that still connected into there? That's all connected into there. That's connected. Good lord, they're all talk about a mishmash of wires. Right, fuses. Okay, well that works that that works that one. Hey, lights. That works the lights. That powers the fridge thing. Right, but I want it to work the lights. 
plug in the fridge? Uh, oh, hold on a minute. Uh, if I turn that switch on. Okay. Fridge. Does it have lights? Sure. I don't think it has lights. It's whether or not it gets starts to get cold. Right. I mean, the voltage drop. Did it? I mean, something was connected. A lot? Wait, it's one volt. Went to 11 volts. One. Okay. So, I need to reconnect that to that. So, I need to unclamp this thing. Do my... you notice know, so I dragged you out here to help me? You but... won't let me help. But I just feel safer with you here. Does it sound silly? Yes. Well, it's not. You're foolish. It's a compliment. You feel safer with constant judgment? No. I just enjoy your company, Brendan. You enjoy my judgment? Yeah. This is clearly not how to rewire stuff. How do you get that? Okay, so those are clampy things. Can you reuse clampy things? Um, yeah. You can. So if I squish it that way to open it. I don't think it's done anything. Right. And I want to get the wires to go in it. In it! I guess like that. And then, yeah, clamp it shut again. There'll be people out there going, you're doing it all wrong, love. You're going to blow yourself up. If I've done anything obviously stupid and dangerous and wrong, you lot need to tell me because it's the only way I'm going to learn. I will be dead by the time the fun ain't coming. Yeah, I'll have blown the van up. Right, clamp. Please stay clamped. Basically, way we've got lights. Basically... It looks like a bit of a cowboy. And Kev, when I come see you <laughs> about the diesel heater, this is one of the messes that I think I'm going to ask you to get your head round. Okay, this is for... So this switch here will be for the fridge. So I need to get that into that one. See, this should probably have insulation all... Should these have insulation over the whole thing? Is These things. Yes. They should, shouldn't they? Yes. Yes, they should. You pulled them off. The wires seem too big to go in the hole. <laughs> too big to go in the hole. Lighter. That's my lighter for making my cup of tea. Right, not the strongest of connections, but it might just work. Right, so that lights this up. This isn't a lag, it's a spark generator. Yes, yeah, a spark generator. Go plug, you need to okay, and then this plugs the fridge in, and then if I want to turn the I'm sure there's a reason for this. Uh, dipping the voltage somehow. Yes, but yeah, it goes right down to 11 because I'm putting the fridge on. So it drops right down. See, I need an extra... Do I need an extra... It's gone down to 11.3 volts. Which is too much drain, is it not? In my opinion. That will trash my leisure battery. So what I'm saying is, for I need more than one leisure battery, don't I? I mean, it's ridiculous. It's only got one leisure battery in here. I need more than one leisure battery, don't I? Because I can't have the fridge plugged in if it does that just by putting the... What about if I turn the lights off? Still 11.4. With the lights off. 11.4, Yeah, and it's just going to keep going down, isn't it? So I can't use, that. So I suspected I couldn't use the fridge, 11.2, yes, it's too much drain on the battery. Maybe that's why it was disconnected. That's how batteries work. 
well it's it's too much drain which will damage the battery long term apparently so i've been told by those in the know will you stop eating all of my nice thing you've got your have you eaten your spicy he's eating his spicy stuff so maybe that's why this was disconnected now what is that for if i plug that back in there does this do anything it turns all the lights off. Now I've got two light switches. Go figure. Oh, dark back on the so if I put that on there, it... so I've got two switches now that do light switches, Brendan. I still can't remember how to turn that main light on up there. Hmm. Right, and that's still wired up. And that's still wired. What is that one? Bing, bing, bing. What? Take that off. What did I say this one was? I know. Let's plug that in there. It's a switch for something, but I'm unsure what it's attached to. Where does this wire go? This wire goes down. Is that the power wire? Is this the power wire from... No, that's the power wire from the mains means from the leisure battery the leisure battery so that's a power one because that's goes behind there i don't know where that goes right we need to get this connector on this brenda box need more of these brendan you don't have any of these do you no well, why not? Can I attach it directly to that thing? If someone there is probably shouting at me, don't do it, that's ridiculous. <laughs> no, that's wrong. That's, Japan. that's the one. Well, hold on a minute. What about this one? Twist. Oh, well, hold... right. That one's connected. So if I move this plug. Oh, crap. You Sorry. Fool. Just said some naughty words. No, no words. Everything's so thingy. I was going to say that was working fine <laughs> until I just pulled the end off it. Right, where's. There's a knife in there still. We've got what you call it tape, haven't we? Uh, electrical tape. Electrical yeah. tape. How many of you out there are laughing at me, learning how to wire up my van? How many of you gone, don't do that? How many of you going to message me later going, what you've just done means your van's going to blow up in the night? All of these things are highly likely with me doing electrics. I can't remember where I took this from and where I put it. Top one. Top one is lights. Disconnected so many things now, I don't know what I'm touching. Thanks. Where did that go? Yeah. Give it a big push so it's properly shut because otherwise the cold air comes in. Thanks, boy. I've got biscuits in here. Do you want biscuits? I've got a macaroon or something. Stop eating all my chocolatey stuff. Mm -hmm. Not many people would get away with that, you know. It's only because you're my son. I can't personally kill you. Because, mm -hmm. you know, it goes against motherly nature. If anyone else trying to get hold of my chocolate would, would be having death as a result. Why? Did the light just flicker then? Yeah. Despite the fact... I've got the light switch disconnected. How is that? How is that possible? Right. That's the lights working. On and off. That's connected up. This is connected up. That's connected up. This is connected but disconnected from power. I 
have no idea what the rest of these things do. I seriously don't know what the rest of those do. No, thank you, thank you. No, that's going to be a speak to Kev about that job. Because I don't understand it. Don't understand it, people. Right, shall we? Well, we've got the lights working and we've got the power. So that's job done, yeah? Okay, so if I put that on there, if I leave this connected but it's disconnected and put that there, and Brendan can put the panel back on. Uh, where's that? Didn't we have one with a loose? If I. I don't like the idea of things not. I should probably put a bit of tape on that, shouldn't I? Because it's. What? Anything that's this should have tape on it, shouldn't it? Um. Because it's. Sure. We shouldn't have anything loose floating about like there was before. Because that could cause shorts and blow me up in my sleep, yeah? Yeah? Sure. You say it like I'm being foolish. Okay. Can I leave you just screwing it all back together again, please, Brendan? Thanks, boy. Okay, no budge. Thanks for your help with the electrical Where'd the other screw go? Uh, there was one on here, and there's one still in it. And then you've got your blade. This is a knif. Thanks, boy. You are a big help to me.